Goes, set. Sprinting away from the 1200 meter marker. Anime, the first one out of the gates. Jasri Silva is right there, but is strong, and there she's a fortress on the outside in the orange. Anime is also a little bit headstrong at the rail. Then comes French Legend, double eight is on the outside of runners. Ariana Shadow at this stage is about six, seven lengths off the leader. They're going a good clip up front as she's a fortress. And then further back, Masala, Accidental Tourist, got eight or nine lengths to make up. The body spinning to the stretch, just over 600 meters to go, and Anna leans the trailer. She's a fortress by two, Anime second, just three silver and double eight. Then comes French legend, Ariana Shadows towards the outside, then Masala, Accidental Tourist. She's a fortress, still leads it coming to the 300. Anime, double eight is running on. Towards the outside, Ariana Shadow. Anime hit the front at the 200. Annalina is running on from behind and double eight getting into the race late. It's still Anime over the last 100 meters. And Anime is clinging to the lead from double eight coming down to the line. And oh, it's close. I think double eight from Anime on the line. Maybe double eight from Anime. I think double eight number nine will get the decision, the last jump. You'll see Luke Ferraris is looking over as double eight wears it down stride for stride and wins that short head decision. Number nine, double eight, pays 10, 30 and 310. Number one, anime second, accidental tourist will just run third and the fourth position will go to Masala. And further back, Ariana Shadow, the tote favorite. Then French legend and Annaline. As we look at the head-on, Anime is the leader. Double eight with the gold cap is running strongly. She's a fortress. Towards the left is Annaline and Arania Shadow on the outside. It's Anime just the leader. Double eight with the gold cap wears it down stride for stride. And you'll find double eight and Stuart Randolph. The last jump, they get up to win a close decision. That's the running of the sixth. Back to the studio. Just seen 008 and has come through to win the eighth fold path from the Anthony Stable, winning a short head from Anime. Greg's going to join us in the box here. Now she's a horse who's got the ability and she's taking on some lively opposition. Yeah, yeah, Sheldon, she, she won a good race. Eh? Her last run was good. She was up there, up at the, she was up with stronger horses and it was a good run. Uh, I think she's above average this filly and she'll win her races there. Well, nice for the stable to have these up and coming youngsters. Yeah, nice. Good luck to Dan. He's not easy, but he's young and he's jumping around. Good luck to him. He deserves a good horse. Well done. Thank you. Let's get Dan into the box here. Now we've heard you've got to train the horses, but you also got to train the owners. You came here with confidence today. Uh, yeah, because my son Karen, we've been going through the baby all the time. And I said, hey, there's something about this special horse of mine. Karen said, no, we went too high on the merit rating. I said, no, no, no. I think we'll leave it on this race. And I think she will take on this big gun. He said, you sure? I said, yeah, let's leave it on there. And then we heard the sad news that Ashton cannot ride for me. Then we heard about Stewie coming on. I know Stewie for many years. I said, no, Stewie's a good boy. Let him take it on. I think we'll have a big chance today. When Stewie won the fourth race, I mean, third race, and then he came back and won this race for us. Well, why not? But I dedicate this race to my beautiful wife who missed out again today, and my grandchildren and my family out there. They all support me, even the guys around me in the, in the tire company what I have. This has been great, guys, because I'm shocked myself because a cheap buy like this to do so many great things in a few weeks. I mean, it's only it's like his fourth run and, and to have. have the barrier trial you won, and then you won two more races. I mean, this, this is magic. It's nice when a plan comes together, so enjoy the moment. Yes, and, and I thank uh, Greg. Greg always gave me confidence like with Peter. Peter always said, hey, you have a good one. Yeah, and he always, this young boy has been my side. And even fact, the, most of the guys at the race course, too, they love me for what I have. I said, guys, no matter I'm a small horse owner, but I'll enjoy my spots. Super. Thank you. Let's get Stuart Randolph into the box here. And uh, you've really bounced back with a bang, a nice double today. Yeah, no, I must say a big thank you to Mr. Anthony and well done to the owners. Uh, it was a nice pick-up ride, you know, it's unfortunate for Ashton, but so I was able to, to fulfill for him. 
The likely pacemaker who moved up at the top of the lane, Anna May, looked to skip and then you were slowly wearing down. Yeah, very good. One stage you got away with me. And also, with, you know, with the claiming, it also helps. But I must say, no, this filly dug down deep and she really fought on resiliently to get to, get to the other horse. No, well done and a big thank you to, to Greg again. Nice youngster, so she had that come on look about her and the owners are very passionate. They were quite a beat. <laughs> yeah, very passionate, yeah. No, I must say, as you said, for a young horse slightly raced, yeah, she's going well, so I'm sure they'll have some fun with her. Well done. Thanks very much. Thank you. Stuart Randolph coming back and number nine, double O eight, grabbing anime on the post there. And that's the wrap for the time being.